All right, what's up, bros? We're back with a little update on the Can-Am. I want to go over a few uh, new products we're going to be putting on it just to get performance fixed up. So first off is going to be some radius rods. Uh, if you don't know, these are the radius rods in the back here. So yesterday we received a beautiful box from Tatum UTV. If you don't know those guys, they've been making sand cars, uh, killing it for a long time. And now they've got a good UTV line. We're going to check these out. These are billet. We're going to do like a little unboxing for us here. So you can see these are not stock, but these are also not ideal. These radius rods here do not have any adjustability other than the bottom one. And so we want to be able to adjust these too. Uh, this will be able to adjust the toe in and a better alignment to get a better handling vehicle. Uh, this is from Nico Festino, Fest Motorsports. It's helping me out get this thing dialed in. These are solid chromoly, they work great, no problems. Other than we're missing adjustability and you can see some of the clearance. Over the other ones you're going to see that they come up higher so less chance of getting hit by rocks. Radius rods, high ground clearance from Tatum. Unboxing. You like that? There you go. Nice card. It says thank you. Thank you for your support. Tatum UTV. Go ahead and give them a follow. And we have a radius rod. Look at that. All adjustable. And there's the beauty. It's got that little uh, kink in there to, for the ground clearance and it's got the adjustability for the toe-in. So we're gonna open these ones up. I almost wish it was in uh, raw so you could see how, um, how it's all machined, but it's okay. How it looks. Nice piece. So here they are, there's the bottom. I believe this is the top. Got that extra clearance, you got another couple inches, you know what they say about a couple inches. Uh, it's a beautiful piece, comes with all the Himes, missile lines, fully adjustable here. This one's adjustable. Definitely a cool piece, the machine works awesome on them. So I'm going to take you through uh, before and after as we install it, but today this is what you're going to get an update. This one, this is the bottom one, it's fixed there, you're going to get more ground clearance by that kink, so you know you got a couple inches there. Again, more ground clearance and adjustability in there that's key and this one's got adjustability on both sides i believe that's to really dial in the toe you know the car is not going to be 100 percent straight so anything you can do to uh fine tune it in the himes is going to be helpful so it's really light it's a really nice part nicely machined aluminum and it does have the adjustability i'm going to be interesting to compare the weight of the chromoly, but it's gonna look good. I like it. Check it out. We're gonna follow it through with a install video once it's on, and I'll show you a before and after. But I just wanted to give you guys an unboxing and show you where we're at. So definitely nice stuff from Tatum UDV. That'll be it for these. We're gonna get these installed along with a couple of other little goodies that I'm gonna show you shortly. But uh. It's just about getting these things dialed in, working better, especially on the firm roads down here. Get a bit more of the adjustments of the toe. A lot of it's above my pay grade, but uh, luckily we got good people working with us for that.
And give us a follow, like, subscribe, all that stuff, smash bells or whatever the YouTubers say nowadays. And follow along this, uh, this Can-Am build that we've been slowly but surely getting improved on for the racing series down here in Baja Sur. She's dirty, we took it out yesterday, had a little fun. New dash is coming soon. Be the next series of upgrades. But she's ready to race uh, in June after these little updates.